it's your boy Pack O Matic, and today I'm going to be playing Super Mario Odyssey Coinless. So what do we have here, huh? Well, last episode we moved on to the poisonous forest, and uh, I know our biggest enemy here, Ninja Coins. How they work are very simple. They are coins that you cannot see. You're actually kidding me. Uh, okay, but like they're coins that you cannot see or find unless you take a look at them. God, this controller is shaking. Like, listen, if I press A, it'll start vibrating. Like, it's so aggressive. And the HD rumble is only normal. But I need it for certain uh, moves. Wait, this isn't going to fix it, is it? Okay, I'm going to make it weak. Okay, it's weak, that should fix it. Cause some stars actually need it. Cause without rumble, you can't it won't even exist and you can't get stuck. I suck. Leave that poison to you, clap, clap, clap. More like leave that poison to myself so I can die off my coins. Oh yeah, there are a ton of stuff we want to avoid. First, the rocks. To again, many more ninja coins. Did you see those? They appeared when I walked into them. And if I throw Cappy into them, they'll also appear. And then Cappy will come back collecting those ninja coins that you revealed. Oh my god. Stop triggering me. I hate this. Actually, though, I hate it. Alright, good. I finally died off that one coin. But I accidentally went down here. Duh. Oh, that was hard to shake. Okay, I just wasted two minutes. So let's get into it. So first of all, what we're really going to need to avoid is ninja coins. Also, remember, we're not allowed to buy anything and purple coins don't really count. But just for funsies, we'll avoid them. But remember, they do not count because they're not the global coin counter, and and they only count for one place. So even then, they don't count. Anyways, this place, that's uh, where we got our last star and where we left off and got the star. So uh, yeah, now we're here. Ow. So the best thing to do with these uh, pieces of poison is to just try and evade them. Like, really, you're better off evading them. Also, I don't want to try and heal myself, because, I mean, I will want to die off some coins, so I might as well. Okay, good. Alright, here we go. Yeets. Nope. I killed myself. This is bad. Very bad. Let's try here instead. So the next thing I'm going to do is try and avoid these coins. Because, you know, ninja coins. These evil, aggressive coins. Luckily, I know this, I think, leads us to a 2D. Yeah, it leads us to a uh, somewhat 2D section. But seriously, if this is a basically, if this is a 2D section, like... If this is basically 2D gameplay, then why then why would you even have that uh, like pixel thing? Like that's what the pixel stuff is for. The pixel stuff is because you don't have to do this. So why don't they just make that a retro pipe? I don't know. Oh, probably because you need the ledges and stuff. And you know, since it was based off to. Uh, Super, Mar Super Mario Bros. 1, you know, right? Okay, so first you gotta roll, 
Then you gotta jump. Jump. What? What? How is that even possible? No. Okay, these are hard coins. And I mean, you can if you. No. <laughs> no. I hate you. I hate you. But if it's less than ten, I'm I'm Gucci. Okay. No, I give up on this star. Okay. So what I'm going to do is very simple. The goal, don't touch poison, or rather, well, don't touch a coin. So what we should do is in, instead of eat the poison, evade it. So you see this? Yeah. No, you stupid. I hate you. Jump like that. And then be ready to ground pound and jump up in the air. And then throw your cap because you don't want to die again. Da -da -da -da. Uh oh. Hey, I think breaking that bucket of his. Whoa. No. Yep, that's mine. How? These hitboxes, boy. Okay. Yeets. Oh. Okay. Yeets. Oh, let's go, boy. No. No. Ha ha. Get wrecked. You suck. Okay, we need to be careful. And be on the lookout for this. Our greatest enemy. Oh my god, is this the only way they move? Because if so, why? Alright, good. So honestly, for the uh, part that should have been retro, I mean... For this part, I actually totally get it. Wait. Okay, I'm gonna have to wall jump. Because I found a path. Wait, these are normal bricks? Come on! Give me a break! Anyways, I just found this uh, thing. And we're gonna need the moons from it. Because there might be a moon. Because... You see, I saw this part right up here, so I thought maybe I can grow up, see what I get. Nut. I get a power move from breaking the nut. The nut in the red maze. Good. Oh, oh, look at that. Okay, we gotta be careful. Yeet. Die. No! Killing it gives you a coin. Oh, wait. These are spawn points. Oh. Well, then. Ye. Run. Go for your life. Run and jump. We'll just, like, walk. Anyways, a 2D segment like this, I understand, but for the 2D segments of that previous one, yeah, not worth it, because, you know, like... You can still swim, but I think it just needs the extra moves to make it a bit easier. But for that one, I understand, because, you know, captures and nuts don't exist in the retro. So, like, you know, you'd have to throw Cappy in the retro. Yeah, not fun. Nor can you bring captures into retro segments. So, like, you get it. They wouldn't want to have to change their entire... Bruh. I just stepped on it. It's just like, hi, step... Piranha plant dies. Okay, we need to wait for these evil coins to dis to despawn. Fine. If you're not gonna despawn, then never mind. It's just like if you're not gonna despawn, despawns. Never mind. <laughs> That's so funny. Anyways, now that we have this moon, we can move on. Oh yes. Okay, remember, these sneaky ninja coins. What you want to do is not throw Cappy. Because when you run on a ninja coin, you won't collect it. But first, you'll reveal it. Then after that, you can collect it. Also, I think there's a moon up there, so we should grab it. You gotta do is run. Make your way across. No! No! 
Yes, I am so pro. Look at me, boy. Nut. I do not care. Ha. Is this like nut? Hope. I just ground pound it like a beast. Okay. Coin equals so bad. You can just walk past and then be done with it. Oh god, these vines. So bad. Okay, we need to be careful. Because remember, the ninja coins are out to no 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 no. Make us have to kill ourselves a ton. In fact, more than we've already killed ourselves, because we've killed ourselves enough times. Lol. Let's go. Okay. These are usually spots that we recommended. Sometimes they're not. Oh, wait, okay. Oh, look at that. Okay, don't worry about the two coins. Later we can just kill ourselves and lose them. Okay, Nut. Aw, oh, man. We've got three power moves from Nuts! How many, how many... Are Nuts, like, power move generators? Because every time we end up breaking a Nut, we always get a power move. So I don't get this. Do they just magically generate power moves or something? Scree. Ree. Ooh. Scree. -ree. 17. I could have used my bro character. Okay. Now, this is a brutal that spits out poison. What's his name again? Let's see here. No. Oh, yeah. Birds not of a feather. Local birds here seem remarkably fond of their mechanical neighbors. <clears throat> hmm, let's see here. Do I see anybody? Nope. Flowers is a way of life. If you see flowers on any visit, you might be lucky enough to see this theme. Garden so ray bouquet. Bouquet features giant white flowers that charm all who lay eyes on it. As you might guess from the name, it's stuck for, by for the most popular bouquet for wedding ceremonies. Sought by planning by wedding planners the world over. Wait. If that's our current location and there's barely any flowers, then Bowser is evil because he took basically every single flower. Because, I mean, taking a few is okay. But just taking a ton of them... Okay, remember, there are no coins here. I think it's only when you hit him. Like these. Like, look at that. Bam. See? He shoots out coins, but if you do what I just did, you should be good. Okay, now I can punch him and push him. This is good, because if I push him away, then cool. Oh, whoops. Wait, did I collect the extra coin or did I not? Okay, looks like these menacing coins have despawned. And more menacing coins appear, but I epically jump over them to assert my pro gamer dominance and obliterate a rock that has a heart in it, asserting even more of this pro gamer dominance that I have talked about seconds ago. Uh oh, whoops. Okay, I can die them off, especially if I fail the boss. Re... Yeets! You died, kid! Uh-oh! There was gonna be coins all around him. Oof. And a triple moon to go with it. Okay, there's no coins. No. Da -na 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 -na. Look at these shiny shoes. Okay, we've got them. Now let's go away. <coughs> uh oh, now we have to get here. Okay, with only 14 minutes spent, I think it's good that we, uh, you know, 
go there. Oh yeah, why am I walking on the grass when I know that I'm gonna get coins? Yee oh. What's a these? The monster's minions must not discover the sacred flower field. The entrance is just ahead, but we dare not attempt it. We need assistance. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't even try. Oh my god, I hate these motion controls when it has to happen. Okay, so instead we gotta go here, but first... Wish I may, wish I won't. Why is this bullet not... Oh, right, I keep on forgetting. At least these don't give us coins. Come on. Oh my god, I'm stupid. Pull the level to receive a seat. You're actually kidding me. This should be far enough. Bam. I'm ahead of the beat. Oh god! I don't know why. I kicked my foot. Oh god! I feel the layer of skin. You're kidding me, guys. Okay, I'm done mourning over the loss of some of some skin. Now let's go. Recharge station is crowded. Recharging, recharging. Huh? Oh my god, it was glowing. So I'm just like, huh? Ground pound it and then get him. I just ground pound it and then straight up get a moon out of curiosity. Okay. Also, I like how the lower the battery, the rustier they get. And it's just like, waited too long. He's just way too rusty. That's so sad. Like, you can't use the others because the only one that's working has a long line. We're going for the robots probably because like it takes forever to recharge. Okay, okay, okay. Let's go. Oh, come on. I, I suck. Okay, I was going to like... Nope. I'm not walking through that. Because I can still get other moons, so it's not like I'm forced to. Whereas if I was truly forced, then I'd have no choice but to do so if I wanted to make any progress at all. But at th but in this case, I was not. Oh yeah, if I get all the Goombas to stack, I can whoa a little Goomba. I can whoa this for no one. Huh? No! But then I can like pull her and then you know get a boom. Because she's so happy. And then I just and then I just come in and take the moon and then she gets horrified. Because oh my god, there's the enemy to all Goomba kind. We must murder him. But I can't. I'm too scared, especially because of how many Goombas he's stomped on before. Come at me, boy. You're never getting on. Also, I really want to jump on all these Goombas and ground pound them for the fun of it. But no, I won't. Because, you know, a bunch of coins that I have to kill myself for, and also because it's unnecessary. Yee! I really wish I could ground pound them. No! You're kidding me! Well, it's not like I can't die them off, can I? Anyways, what you have to do next is ground pound and jump. Jump. Use that as a ledge. And now, let's let's uncover a secret moon. Bam. Bam. Whoa. Bam. No. Bam. 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 Fine, 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 fine. No. Bam, bang, bang, no! Boom! Night! No! No! My work is complete. Oh, right, I can wall jump. Anyways, ye. Oh no, what'll I do? Not clean? 
but uh, the entrance to the moon. I mean, it works. Come on, it works. See? Okay, ma'am. So now that we have that, oh god! You guys have to stare at a nightmare. Hey, this helps a lot, man. Oh my god, I'm so sorry for you guys. Oh, I'm so sorry. <sighs> Please don't be mean in the comment section below, okay? Because guys, listen. Again, I could have used the Elgato, except this time I didn't test if they're corrupt or self-destructed. They didn't, but this time they, there came a new problem. Audio wouldn't, would not, just audio hated me. Sound didn't appear at all. Oh great, coin rings. But like, sound didn't appear at all and I had no choice. So, you know. No, wait, what? I found this cat peach, but she's gonna give me a coin and I don't want coins. So, you know how that goes. But I found this cat door that could maybe get me some moons so I don't have to deal with the bouquet. Let me guess, fine. Yup, Vimeo's. Oh, look at that, a moon right there. Pretty simple to grab. I just need to grab some Goombas to roll this moon and to trick it into liking me. Yeet! Yee! And then I can go jump up. Goomba Squad! Please don't go away. Wait, what? No! Oh! Wait. No! Look at that! Pro jumping almost died, boy. Anyways, that's what you don't exactly have to do. You don't really need to be so pro, but like, you can if you want to show off and flex. Flex your big gamer hands, like I did. But really, I only did that so I survive. So, uh, yeah. No! Like, I only did it so I could survive and not have to go through, uh, you know, getting those Goombas. So apparently it's a must to get those Goombas up there. So I might as well jump up in the air. Jump up in the air. Try to be scared. Jump up in the air cause I'm afraid. Jump up in the air. Why do you even dare? No, 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 no! I suck! I'm literally using the shadows to guide me. Come on. Bam! Bam! Look at that! Oh, look at this! I only, I only have two more moons to go. But did you see that epic gamer move? I didn't even try. I just yeeted myself for it, knowing that I would die if I didn't. And then I survived and got the moon. Well, that was a uh, extremo pro, anyways. No! Impossible. What I must do. Yeah. No! That's not what I wanted. Ugh. Normally I try to get go for every uh <gasps> rains. I hate those. Okay. Yee ow. Okay. I expected that to hurt for Mario, but it didn't. Okay. What I really need to do is get up there. And at this point, I don't care how many coins I can collect, because, you know, killing yourself, lose coins. Yeah, you know that. Oh my god, I can't even get near the edge. But look at this.
No, no, yes! And then I can go save. Bam, bam, bam. I'm in an elevator in a first person shooter like in Banjo Kazooie. Oh no. This, these are dark times. These are dark times for Cornless Runs. Well, then the least I can do is try and run away. Well, then I'm gonna have a ton of permanent followers. Oh no! This is getting treacherous. Oh no! It's raining fireballs, and now there's even extra tanks. This is not, this is not helping with the amount of times I have to kill myself just to get anything. Oh my god, all that for a power move that hurted so much. Ouch. Well, it's not gonna hurt as much as, a, as how many times I have to die. I have to twat, tie, die like four times. And to get back. Welp. It's sim. Okay, I thought I couldn't climb up. Whatever, it's simple. Besides, this doesn't increase my death, my death count. Oh my god, I have to get somewhere else just to die once. To a point where I'm just better off trying to play the level with, without collecting a coin so I don't die. Okay, this ain't going to be too hard. I mean, you just gotta shoot these Bowser faces. And hope that they blow up. That's all I need to go, but that's all I need. But you know what? I'll spend those three minutes on beating the boss. And oh my god, this must be pain for you guys to watch. And now it's not. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry! I'm a terrible YouTuber! Ugh, I'm so bad at this job. I'm so bad. All I want to do is record for you guys to see. <laughs> I mean, it is possible to understand, it's just harder to. And I'm sorry, blame me, blame me. Comment section, do you hate me? Tell me, if you're a true fan, then show if you actually hate me. Like, tell me. Tell me in the comment section. Is this, does this quality suck? Because if it does, thank you for your honesty. Like, just be honest, guys. If you don't, then come on. You can tell me the quality sucks and give me a ton of reminders. And then also, like, you know, say like. But don't worry, I still like your content. Do not mess with me, biped. What does that mean? Okay, it's still hard to see here anyways. The Omaiwa Mushineru for a second. Okay. While I have few chances, wish I not, wish I may. Lol, I'm just, I'm just walking to these and breaking the middle block using the shadows. Boom! Yeah. Uh Bam, one last hit equals I die. Bam. Look at me go, guys. Does this make up for it? Probably not. Heck, I don't even need these three extra moons, but it's gonna make it easier. What? No. You know what? 30 minutes. 
Honestly, it's pretty hard to get coins. You just don't want to have to touch the bricks and then bam, that's it. You'll kill the boss, but you know what? Just because I want the video to be longer so you want you can have more watch time. Like, just so you know, defeating this boss does not give you any coins except for when you defeat it, I think. But, like, even then you can easily avoid it and kill them off. You know, like, just kill yourself. Actually, never mind, because I have a ton of coins. Well, then, let's see if I do get coins. No? Well, whatever. For all I know, I think it's still better to run anyways. And smash it in the face. Anyways, just for extended watch time, I want to show it to you. And yeah, I said extended watch time. Okay? I'm admitting that to you guys. Because I want more content to be posted by us, so I mean... That's one way to do so, I guess. Wait, that's it. How am I infinitely jumping? Aiming for the core, kid. No, you're not. You're actually not. You're kidding me. Oh, look at that. Snap. Snap. Okay, you're gonna die. I think I start to get videos every week for ranging from Friday. And it happens from, fri from uh, Friday to Sunday. Maybe a bit later, but I think it's usually at least one uh, video a week. Because that's what's been happening lately. Because every week on the weekends, I think, hey, I need to make a video for the community. So I usually post gameplay videos because they're quick and easy to make. You know, I just show myself playing the game. Like, is there really that much more to it? I mean, other than editing, but even then I don't really do it because I don't have the software and, it's, and we use a Mac, sadly. And as you probably already know, Macs don't have that many apps available that aren't from the uh, Apple Store. And trying to attempt iMovie, well, yeah, uploading from iMovie onto YouTube is pretty hard because it takes forever to upload. So, you know. My God, this controller. Do you feel the vibration? Listen, listen up, okay? Literally, listen to the controller. Do you feel the vibration? Does it at least seem like it's vibrating? Because it is. A lot, like, when I jump, vibrate. So if I say, that means it vibrates. Check this out. Okay, but you get the point, right? Okay, guys. Well, anyways, my job is done here. So, if you want to see more content, then, uh, I'd say it's best that you like and subscribe, because, because if you like and subscribe, our motivation gets better. And, uh, at some point we might open a merch store, I'm not entirely sure. Someday we will.
but not for now, I guess. Yup, and someday this video will be a thing of the past. Anyways, guys, that's it for today. But first, I just want to quickly show you exactly where I am so you guys don't get confused. Where I am, uh, you know, all of a sudden in the Gold Kingdom. What was it again? Snow? Oh, like, I was so wrong. Anyways, surprise is here. I really am going to watch rewatch this and see how much an atrocity it is to stare at just during the start for like a, a whole portion. In fact, almost so long near the end. Shut up, I know how to work, don't worry. It says they're known for their fashion. Oh, this famous wedding gown. They're called the Lodge Lady Dress. Okay, here we go. Why is it spewing out sand? Sand isn't what it should be, uh, you know, throwing. Anyways, there. That's it for today, guys. So, don't forget to smash that like button and smash that subscribe button. So, yeah. Bye-bye.